Imagine an Atlantis-like megalopolis rising from the sea, an urban development similar in size to New York's Manhattan that boasts thriving businesses in residential districts to transform not just one city, but an entire country. It sounds quite utopian, but one country in Africa is building such a city from scratch. Want to know which country? Stay tuned to find out more. Named as Eco-Atlantic, the city is being built from the ground up off the shore of Victoria Island in Nigeria, near Lagos. And like Dubai's iconic Palm Jumeirah Island, sand is being utilized to build the foundation. But is it really as fascinating as it sounds? Let's explore this billion-dollar megaproject that has become one of the most discussed development projects in the world. Hello, and welcome to our channel Building the Future. In today's video, we are going to give you exclusive details about a mega city project in Africa that is worth $6 billion. So make sure to watch the video till the end to find out more. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos. Eco Atlantic City, also known as Nigeria International Commerce City, is a great new coastal city being built on Victoria Island next to Lagos, Nigeria. It is being built on land reclaimed from the Atlantic Ocean mainly to solve the chronic property shortage in the world's fastest growing megacity. Initially conceived in 2003 as a solution to environmental hazards arising from the flooding of Lagos Bar Beach, the construction of the Eco-Atlantic project began in 2008. The city stands on 10 million square meters of land wrested from the ocean and is protected by an 8.5 kilometer long wall. In addition, Having a total of 10 districts, it is projected to be the size of Manhattan Skyscraper District. According to reports, the city will be self-sufficient and sustainable, including modern urban design, its own power generation, clean water, advanced telecommunications, and efficient living standards. Over the years, the Eco-Atlantic project has evolved into housing, one of the most expensive real estate locations in Africa. It is a central point for investors who benefit from rich development growth based on massive demand and a gateway to the continent's emerging markets set to become the next generation of real estate in Africa. Eco-Atlantic City combines residential, commercial, financial, and tourist accommodations in a location powered by state-of-the-art high-tech infrastructure. The construction of the city was offered to China Communications Construction Group, a company that works in the field of marine dredging and landfill operation. The first phase of the project, consisting of dredging construction of the dam and sand filling, will take about six years over a total length of 6,500 meters and an average width of 1260 meters. Moreover, about 91 million cubic meters of sand will be used in total to construct the base of the city. Eco Atlantic is protected by a coastal revetment known as the Great Wall of Lagos, which is a planned 8.5 kilometers long barrier constructed primarily of rock and faced with concrete macropod armor. South Energix Nigeria Limited, the developer and urban planning company for the Eco-Atlantic City has unveiled the development plan for the first phase of urban development. According to the company, the buildings to be built in the first phase of the Eco-Atlantic City include a 26-story building that will bear the name of Azuri Peninsula. It will be home to 120 luxury apartments. The development will also include a five-star marina and yacht club with an attractive walkway, high-end shops, cafes, and a wealth of amenities in a curated and sophisticated setting. The architecture will preserve the award-winning global design and provide the most affordable place to live, work, and invest. The second phase of the project is expected to last two years. In this phase, first-class roadworks, the construction of drainage systems, and an own power plant for constant power supply will be carried out. It will also install a water supply system, sewage network, and treatment systems, such as those provided in developed cities around the world. Therefore, Eco-Atlantic is said to be an antidote to Lagos' deepest recession in 30 years. Adding to this, the city is expected to create 250,000 new jobs and address the housing shortage caused by the growing population. 
But what makes the development of Eco-Atlantic particularly remarkable is its location, as the planned city directly borders Lagos, since Eco-Atlantic was built by dredging and piling up land worth 10 kilometers. The peninsula was virtually non-existent before the project began in 2009. The result is that Eco-Atlantic looks like an island created out of nothing. The Eco-Atlantic city is said to be at least 40% larger than the existing Victoria Island. The city targets 250,000 residents and 200,000 commuters who flock to work on the island every day. Furthermore, as a concession holder and principal developer, Eco-Atlantic City Development is authorized to lease any property. It is then up to the investor to build what he wants on his land. According to the set guidelines, Eco-Atlantic will offer the most modern amenities available worldwide today. First-class roads with canals for the drainage of surface water are provided in addition to an enviable sewage collection system. So, this city has everything a person could ever wish to have as the development includes everything from skyscrapers to luxury apartments, a new financial district, a private power grid, and a shopping boulevard model after New York's Fifth Avenue. Other features include an independent 24-7 to 7 power supply, fiber optic communication links to each property, elevated street levels to accommodate underground parking spaces above groundwater, seamless documentation and construction permit process, and two large marinas connected by an internal waterway. Talking about its developers, Heco Atlantic Development is being carried out as a public-private partnership with private companies and investors providing the funding, whilst the LIGO state government remains a strategic partner along with the federal government. Experts say the project will cost at least $6 billion and a square foot of land in the city is now being sold for nearly $2,000. While Eco-Atlantic will alleviate the housing problems in the metropolis, its great potential lies in the economic benefits for the state and the population with the establishment of the free trade zones and the current dynamic focus on infrastructure development. So, those who need a quieter and safer environment for their operations and business and want to be part of a new border can move to the new city. For savvy investors, Eco-Atlantic City means much more than just rising land values in Lagos, as Nigeria continues on its unstoppable path to becoming Africa's financial capital. Therefore, an investment in Eco-Atlantic which is presently recognized as the world's most promising growth horizon will open up unprecedented opportunities to unlock the broader potential of the continent as a whole. Moreover, South Energix Nigeria Limited claims it would be one of the world's greatest a residential, business, and financial center. The developer also expects that it will encourage tourism and alleviate Lagos at overpopulation. But how are they intending to do it? While it is still under construction, the newly created city is holding concerts and sporting activities. There are so many things which will amaze you about this mega project. However, there is hardly a project without controversy, and the Eco-Atlantic City is no different. Residents who live nearby criticize Eco-Atlantic City as the ongoing construction work has recently caused coastal erosion and ocean flooding. According to the locals nearby, the amount of water displaced from Bar Beach would sweep away to another area threatening the coastal landscape of Nigeria. However, to cope with this the Great Wall of Lagos is supposed to prevent coastal erosion and flooding and protect this future city. We hope you enjoyed this video. We will be back soon with more amazing content so stay tuned and don't forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our latest updates. You can always change your mind later. Thanks for watching.